Hello. For those of you guys been watching, I've been trying to figure out how to make a 308 old school style round work in this, used for like a 3030 or whatever you like. But anyhow, it's an all purpose push one. I wanted it to work in this AEA regulated Challenger. It's a Challenger Pro that Bintac sent me and I'm happy over it, over the HP Max 30 already I tried two of and I gotta say so far so good and you know maybe I'm gonna shoot this experimental round I've been working on and it's gonna jam and be a big joke on me. Or maybe I'll hit Torso Timmy down there. And also I got Matthew Ross for example. You You sent me a question about, hey, do you have any four, five, sevens? Well, I believe I was, I got the last mold and I was able to get it and I casted some today. And guess what? I need somebody to test. So, uh, let me just go ahead and throw some lead right now. And I'm not, I don't really care much at all about warp. If I hit torso Timmy, then I'm happy. So, okay. Okay, so it's going two up, and oh, I didn't—I forgot the chronograph reading, but I'll put that in the label at the beginning per SOP. What what I have been doing. Okay, and these have skirts too because when I'm pulling these back and stretching them, so I'm just going to go where that last one went, and I'll try and—I just want to get it on the metal, guys. That's all. Well, whoops. That was a shirt pocket button there nearly. Okay, that's a 742.8. So there's a number that randomly. Now, I just, this has a read feedback. Here's another one. They have like nearly a one mil uh, skirt on the back that when I actually sight them in and get to this, <laughs> K4 and 750.4. 750.4, I'm sorry, I, I'm just attempting to aim for the same center spot and, and hoping, like this one feels like it might jam, but because of the lever on this pro, it's, I'm gonna say I've, I already like it. Come on now, let's try and just get within the air. <laughs> 670.2. And thank you, Eddie Mike, for telling me about this particular chronograph. I've gotten so sick of all the really expensive ones and all the numbers align and everything. So anyhow, let's see about getting another round out. <laughs> 749 point something, 749 point something. And this is at 54 yards, and I started at about 41.50. I... Oh, I'm finally getting a little drop, potentially, but, you know, I'm bouncing around on a block of wood here, rack, literally, on a, on a motorbike rack. So, yeah. Uh, and these are only stretched. I just stretched these, or pressed them on the bench, these 308s. I've lost track of how many I've shot, but that's what that chronograph... <clears throat> Excuse me, all I get, and that's what that chronograph is helping me with. I can be very precise with my data recollection because of that. Hey, so I just accounted like for half a mil dot, and that came out to 449.9, y'all. Okay, so now here's another one, and this has got like a three quarter inch skirt that, or I, three, three quarter mil skirt, like 0.75 millimeter at best. And that's just from me sizing it down. I'm going to account for I'm go, what I'm doing from my point of view at 9.3x is that right now I am presently at, on my perspective, four hash marks down and basically shirt pocket left gun review. And now by what by where I say that now I'm getting by this more by the carriage bolt, which by the way for people that familiar with metal shooting that's always a good perspective when you're looking at people shooting you can tell what kind of targets size targets they're using by what your carriage size is going to be so I believe I said I was going three or four hash marks below the left shooter pocket not bad you know and these have skirts I literally casted them and I do this do the, the sizing that I believe will to work the best and this is why I'm doing these numbers here because I want to know if I'm going to gain money 
Batman game. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna, I don't know. I'm thinking about how much money I just spent on molds again. If I want to gain power, the more power I get, the better. So there's 741.9, 741.9. Like, this is just, it's, it's working and it's working well and when I sight this in and I'm not using a motorbike stand and and uh, a piece of old alders, uh, 50, 751, 751. That's pretty cool. And I, I, because these numbers aren't dropping, I'm gonna keep shooting these and even though they, they take me a while to make, like I, I wish they were a fast thing for me to produce so I could like sell a few of them, but they're, they're just too, they're just a specialty round. Now, all the dogs. <laughs> hey, bud. Everybody's fired up. They all love guns around here. 745.3. I'll try and pick it up, y'all, here. These dogs are start. Okay, 741. There's a whole bunch of different gun dogs in the area, naturally. Now this skirt's all messed up. Like, I say skirt because of the sizing. But look at that. I mean, it's still hitting the shirt pocket. Rectangle perimeter. Not the button, but not. These foot pounds are going to be fun for me to calculate tonight. See, I enjoy doing all this. I'd be doing this long before ever there was a YouTube. And I don't mean me and my 12 week channel, 731, 731. And I think it's like 13 weeks now or something like that. I don't know, it's been like a time warp. This is just like what I do every day anyhow. I mean, and, and I'm not kidding. My whole family, they find it amusing. It's 723. I'm just doing what I love doing anyhow and I just happen to be recording it and I really don't laugh much. This life has been well traveled. 701 but it's also made me into, well, how I am. You learn a bunch when you go other places on this globe. 187. Now I can tell, obviously, anyone would tell that I'm losing the regulator. I have a set at factory regulator. I mean, at 673.5, but it's 54 yards. The point of impact is still perfectly fine for what I'm trying to do. I'm just trying to make foot pound evidence 670. 670. And Sometimes when the coyotes come in the woods, the whole neighborhood gets to hear. Okay, 655, 655. I'm pretty sure this 300 is the better option. And I compare and contrast the two, the two 99s versus these threes. The dogs are wanting to go run, so I should wrap this up. I'm, it's 645. This is a firm feed, but you know, it might be really, you know what, just, let's just see, I'm going to go for the belly. Oh, there we go, that's the end, guys, no go. Let me look at the pressure. That's what I was waiting to see would happen, and this happened at uh, 20, or 2050. Anyhow, that's all, and thanks for uh, watching.